Okay, everybody, I'm back. Um, I deeply apologize for the last, I think it was four episodes when I was doing that session. I tried doing the audio on a different program, and unfortunately it sounded like absolute garbage when I checked it later. Um, I did a benchmark test. It sounded all right, but in the long haul, I noticed it sounded a lot worse, so I'm going to go back to doing it the old way. It takes me a lot longer to get the episodes out this way, but I feel the quality is far worth it. <laughs> it's far more worth it for me to do it this way. Um, because God knows I hate audio spikes. Hate them. I hate videos that sound like garbage. <laughs> Um, okay, map. So if I recall, we're going to be walking somewhere. Where are we walking? Somewhere over to the west, I believe. Yes, yes. And we need to go to Farkarth. That is correct. Where do you want to go? Climb and back and we'll be off. Okay. Nice weather for a ride. Hope it lasts. Come on, Uthgard. Oh, fine. Be left behind, you annoying lady. At times. But I always go back for and reload. I definitely notice. Oh my god. I don't know, really. The blacksmith is offering a reward for a dog he saw on the road. I was hoping you'd seen it. I guess I'll stay on the lookout. Keep your nose clean while you're here, outsider. Staying safe, I hope. Not an outsider. Heard that one from the co Heard about you. Really? Um. I have a lot of respect for Asian school. Skyrim could use more people. Try not to judge Falkreath too harshly, visitor. The war has been hard on us. Who's Whatever. responsible for the cemetery here in Portland? I take her. I love how everyone's like telling me stuff and I just don't care. I'm just running through. Oh, look at that. There's like a little graveyard. Oh god, there's more. Um We don't care about the Southgard. Oh, it's lightly raining. How nice. How nice. That, however, does not look nice. It is not where we are trying to go, so we are going to skirt around it. The heck was that? Uthgird, why is there a dead person over here? You know what? I don't really- What? You know what? I don't care. Is the ass? Oh, you know Where is it? Oh, well. That's right, Uthgur. Die. You foul beastie. That's right, you gotta land, bitch. Where are you? That's right.
don't know, maybe Eskert will like that. Meh. What's your thing do, Eskert? I don't know though, you might need What do you need to take? Nothing, I just wanna give you some stuff. Twenty four to um See if you like that. I don't Okay, so you do not like that. That's fine. It's fine, Uthgard. Um, alright. I really need to... Come on, Uthgard. Oh god, what'd you find? Uthgard found something that she really wants to destroy. You go, Uthgard. You go. Oh god. Apparently that elk really offended Uthgard. You think I'm afraid of you? I don't know if I'm gonna be able to get up this. Oh yeah, I can. Come on, Uthgard. There's plenty of elk this way. Uthgard? That's right, Uthgard. Dumbass. Sometimes she's pretty dumb, guys. Oh. Actually startled me. Yeah. That's what I thought of that. I love the creepy music. This bunny's just like, yo. Uthgard better be with me or I will not be pleased. <laughs> Uthgird. Damn it. Why do I always gotta do this stuff alone? I don't recognize you, but I sense that you're one of us. Who are you? I ask the same question of you. The last of the Nightingale Sentinels, I'm afraid. I've defended the Sepulchre alone for what seems like an eternity. Well, Mercer kind of screwed you over, you know. The last? What happened to the rest? We were betrayed by one of our own kind. In fact, I'm to blame for what's happened here. How are you to blame? I was blinded. Blinded by dark treachery masquerading as friendship. Perhaps if I had been more vigilant, then Mercer Frey wouldn't have lured me to my fate and stolen the skeleton key. You're Gallus? I haven't heard that name in a long time. How do you know of me? 
have the key. key. You have the skeleton key. I never thought I'd see it again. And Mercer Frey? I killed his ass. Dead. Then it's over. And my death wasn't in vain. I owe you a great deal, Nightingale. I did this for... Not to get rich. I did it for the guild, You've really. the guild a great deal. And although they may not show it, I'm certain they appreciate your sacrifices. My only regret is that you had to undertake this task alone. Carlyle help me. Carlyle? She's still alive? I feared she'd befallen the same fate, ending up a victim of Mercer's betrayal. No. Then take the key and right all the wrongs. Nothing would bring me more pride than to return the key. But I'm afraid it's impossible. Oh, he's From the moment not I alive. Arrived here, I felt myself, well, die. You're already dead, dude. How can a spirit die? The sepulchre isn't merely a temple or a vault to house the key. Within these walls is the Evermare, a conduit to Nocturnal's realm of Everflow. When Mercer stole the key, that conduit closed, severely limiting our ties to her. <laughs> then I will have to proceed alone. I'm afraid so. I'm weakening, and I can feel myself slipping away. The years without restoration of my power have taken their toll. Whatever damage has been caused can only be corrected by following the pilgrim's path to the heaven there and replacing the key. All right. How does the Ebonair affect all of us? The Ebonair is a conduit through which nocturnal influences our world. Interesting. Not through magic or blessings, but purely through luck. Interesting. Luck is meaningless. Um, what we do involves skill. Oh, I don't really want to say that. I'm sure there's luck involved somehow. Yes, absolutely. Your skill is your own. Don't let anyone ever tell you otherwise. But Nocturnal, she influences our life. Nearly imperceptible assistance we get when we ply our trade. How that... How's that changing the way things are? Think about the guild. About the state it was in when you began. Think about all the little things you might have heard. A pick breaking when it shouldn't have. The clouds in the nighttime sky clearing at the wrong moment. Our access to those bits of luck are what separates us from common bandits. I see. So with the ebon air closed, our lucks run dry. Precisely. There are a few who still call Nocturnal Lady Luck, and for good reason. I see. What will I face at the Pilgrim's Path? I wish I could help you, but I've been a prisoner in this very chamber for the last quarter century. The only possible help I've come across are the remains of some poor fellow who is trying to follow in your footsteps. Perhaps his journey can help? Sure. Okay. Good luck, Nightingale. Let's go with that. 